78 Sports TV here. Salute to the mighty LDBC. Y'all smash the like button, hit the subscribe, turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop a new video. And if you're digging the video, go ahead and share this joint. All right, y'all. So, everybody wants my opinion on Eddie Hearn and Devin Haney's war of words, the back and forth, the beef. Eddie Hearn is basically claiming that Devin Haney has damaged goods and uh, he, he's been so mentally hurt by what happened with the Ryan Garcia stuff and Eddie Hearn is out here trying to say that uh, Ryan Garcia only took the juice to make weight and you know Eddie's trying his best to like kiss Ryan's rectum right and uh, he's speaking like a promoter none of this is a surprise to me because Eddie Hearn is the devil not a devil you understand me not a devil but the devil born of a jackal okay the son of lucifer this is a man eddie hearn i've been telling y'all this for years when he was doing all the shady stuff with deontay wilder i've been telling you this and, and y'all said man well 78 how you cool with eddie and you know how you cool with eddie or Devin being with eddie i'm not cool with it they, they do business I, i'm cool with dhp Devin haney promotions if they do business with Eddie and they're going to get bread from him, break him. I'm cool with that. If you ask me, do I trust Eddie Hearn? No. I had I had opportunities to interview Eddie Hearn, be in the same room as Eddie Hearn. And I said, no, I turned it all down because I understand that he's the devil. But Eddie got a bag. He got connections. And, and, and unfortunately, the brothers have to work with him in order to get where they're trying to go to and get their paydays. That's how it works in the sport of boxing. It's business. You know what I'm saying? But make no mistake about it, Eddie is the devil. Now, with all that being said, um, Eddie's been hating and saying little foul stuff about Devin Haney, but I saw that coming, okay? Devin Haney is not signed, has not signed a promotional contract with Eddie. Uh, at the time, at the time I'm making this video that I know of, Devin is a free agent. He works with different promoters. Uh, keep himself open to go with this network, that network, whoever has the best fights available to him. He's free to move around. Promoters don't like when fighters take the liberty of being renegades. Promoters want you to have a pimp. Okay, you got to choose up. That's how they want it. Renegades set a bad example for the rest of the three or foes on the blade. Y'all know what I'm talking about. And people like Eddie Hearn, who is the pimping, trust me, he is. He got a problem with young Dev and Bill being independent and just working with him and beating him. See what I'm saying? They beating him. They work with him when they need to work with him and they beat him. Eddie don't got no lifetime long-term contract with them and that's what is upsetting Eddie Hearn. So now Eddie has signed, um, according to the reports, he signed Shakur Stevenson to a multi-fight deal. Eddie, I saw this coming a mile away. Shakur Stevenson had been begging for a long time because he wants to be like Devin Haney. Shakur was like, ooh, maybe maybe I'll sign with Eddie Hearn. Maybe Eddie Hearn will come pay for my fights. Maybe I can get with Eddie Hearn. He was begging, you know. Shakur love. Now, now, mind you, Floyd Mayweather was the main one out here talking about what Shakur deserved. Uh, 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 just because Top Rank did you dirty, you shouldn't do another black fighter like Shakur. You shouldn't do, you shouldn't do another black fighter dirty like that. I think Devin Haney and them, they should have gave Shakur, it should have been fair to Shakur. Give him what he deserves. Oh, really? Really, Floyd? Well, it's interesting that you say that because when you had an opportunity to sign Shakur as a free agent, you offered him chump change. How is it that Eddie Hearn outbid you? And he's a white man. You you a black man. You, 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 you care so much about the black fighter, Floyd, right? Yeah, you know, you, you, you brother man. Soul brother number one, Floyd Mayweather. You know, why, 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 how can, explain to me how Eddie Hearn outbid you for Shakur Steves. And from what I heard, to be honest with you, top rank even outbid Floyd. I don't know how true it is. It could just be uh, ninja gossip. But I did hear a rumor that uh, Floyd offered Shakur Stevenson $10 million to sign with him. That's what I heard. I don't know if it's true or not. That's just what somebody called me and told me. 
They said $10 million. Floyd offered Shakur Stevenson. Multi fight deal. And I heard that Top Rank offered him, like, uh, started off with 10 and they offered 15. And I heard Eddie offered more. Somewhere around the 15 range. With a promise to try his best to get him Tank Davis. Right? That's what I heard. Okay? Now, if that's all true, <clears throat> shame on Floyd Mayweather. Shame on Floyd because he's been the main one instigating and, and, and causing all this rift between these young brothers. Floyd is the one who caused the rift between Devin Haney and Tank Davis. Floyd's the one that called the rift between Shakur Stevens. Well, I can't say that. I take that back. Shakur, Shakur, Shakur been a hater. Ever since he went to Devin Haney's house as a kid, he saw that Devin Haney had the real Captain Crunch and not the Captain Crunch with the lizard and the baseball cap. That's where Shakur got jealous. I'm like, man, this real deal Captain Crunch. He got he got the sugar smacks with the with the bear and the frog. I got the sugar smacks with 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 with, with, the, with the African dude on there. See what I'm saying? It's a difference. And, you know, Pop-Tarts versus uh, Tarty Pops, you know what I'm saying, Toasties and all that kind of stuff, it's a difference, bro. Shakur been jealous of Devin Haney for a long time, fam. I don't know what that bird just went down in the water and got him a fish. But Shakur been jealous of Devin for a long time. For a long time, mighty long time. And, uh... So I can't blame that part on Floyd. But the Devin Haney versus Tank stuff is all Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Floyd instigated that to no end. Okay? Um, and Devin Haney and his father are being punished for being renegades, for being their own bosses. You understand? For being their own master. Because they're not playing the game. Because they're not signing these long-term deals. Remember what, what Paulie said about Devin? What was Paulie may be for Devin? Oh, oh, your dad helped you out. Your dad had money. Oh, oh, you know, oh, oh, Devin Haney, his dad had money. Oh, he didn't have to sign these these messed up deals that we had to sign, five-year deals. Uh, Devin Haney didn't have to do that. He doesn't know the struggle. So, Paulie just told you what the real beef is. Because Devin has a father that made the best deals possible for his son. Even Leonard Ellaby told you, hey, shout out to Bill Haney. Team Haney, I'm not mad at them. His father is very smart. He's a good businessman. He got his son excellent money. We not paying him that money. We not we not paying Devin that money. Y'all remember that? I'm not lying. I'm not making this up. Y'all remember when uh, Leonard said this? So <clears throat> Team Haney is being punished for being smart, and Devin got to realize that, that 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 Eddie is not really his friend. Eddie. Might be cool to do business with, but Eddie's not your friend. Eddie is not a devil. I repeat, he's not a devil, but he's the devil. Mm-hmm. Lucifer, Lucifer, son of money, I'm going to chase you out of earth. Lucifer, Lucifer. That's, that's Eddie. That's what they're talking about. That whole song is about, about, about uh, Eddie Edward Hearn. You know? But, so what's going on now? <clears throat> Excuse me. Devin Haney has an opponent. He's, they're going to be announcing that pretty soon here. Um, De Eddie, I mean, Devin has an opponent. And he Devin is going to be going over, I believe, to Saudi and fighting on the Riyadh stuff. Uh, uh, Shakur Stevenson right now is with Eddie Hearn. So they pull some finesse move. And, you know, they, they pull all this little finesse move stuff. But at the end of the day, Shakur Stevenson's opponent is a sucker. Who you fighting again? One of them sucker dudes, uh, left twigs, right twigs, one of them guys. But whoever he fighting, Shakur got to whoop it. He got to stop him. He can't just beat him up. He got to stop him. Because Shakur's last two performances have been, like, people been criticizing Shakur for having so-called boring fights and all that kind of stuff. And he's not been aggressive enough. So now they're giving him a guy, he's supposed to be fooled for Shakur. So we're going to see what happens with this. Y'all let me know what y'all think. 78 Sports TV. Salute to the mighty. LDBC. Y'all smash the like button. Share the video. Hit the subscribe. I'm up out of here though. Deuces, y'all.